I'll, I'm going to teach you how to uh, find X path of a web element. So as a prerequisite, have uh, Firefox installed. So install Firefox and uh, we need to have uh, Firepath and Firebug also installed. I've added uh, the installation link uh, in a uh, download link in the description. So let's go to Firebug first and click on Act to Firefox and click on Install. Later, go to Firepath, click Add to Firefox, click on Install. You'll be prompted to uh, prompted to restart and uh, click on Restart now. So it will restart the browser. So now let's go to uh, Google.com and uh, to know if uh, fire bug is installed you will see this icon bug icon here uh, which shows that fire bug is installed so there are two ways of triggering it either you can press this icon or you can press f12 in your keyboard uh, to get the fire path so i'm going to click on this and uh, click on fire path here and uh, to find uh, the X path of the desired element, all you need to do is click on this uh, cursor as you can see. Click on this cursor and place it on any element of your choice uh, for which you want to find the X path. So in this case, suppose if I want to find X path of privacy, I'm going to click on this. So the field here after X path. This is the X path of uh, privacy. So I'm going to copy and use it in our program. So let's go begin writing a program. In the namespace section, let's add openqa.selenium using openqa.selenium.chrome because I'll be uh, using Google Chrome browser. So I web element web driver driver new chrome driver so this syntax statement will uh, create a new instance of chrome browser so let's navigate to uh, uh, google.com navigate navigate dot go to URL https www dot google dot com I think I missed to add slash here so add slash here and uh, now driver dot find element by dot x path add uh, the x path content which you found and add dot click so now let's run this program so it's going to create a new instance of chrome browser and it's going to go to google.com and in google.com it's going to click on privacy yeah yeah here we go uh, this is the same procedure to find xpath thanks for watching this video in case you like it please subscribe